All right, third quarter of the second round game here of the 2018 USAFL Western Regionals. Seattle leads nine to one over the defending, two time defending national champions. What are these maidens made of? We'll find out in just a moment as the wind picks up and they turn that one inside. Do the maidens, picking that one up is Troy. Handballs it over, he kicks for a goal. That's a pretty good kick and a shot for a goal. And there it is, it's Jessica one who kicked two goals. She finally gets the first one of this one, of this game. And that cuts it back to a two point lead. San Francisco goes to 117-139 for Seattle. And Jessica one who had, as we said, two goals in that last game. I think she was one of the few multiple goal scorers. Nickname of Scoobs because she is a scuba diver. And had played for the national team. And she is a she is definitely been a bit of a poacher around the goal square for the Iron Maidens. Alright. Back in the middle again as it's Smith now in the ruck, it appears to be, or no, it's still win. And out it comes to Peterson who dropped the footy. Great tackle by Bevan English. And that's why she's on the all-world team, folks. So Bevan English looking for options to her left, sends it in that direction, and marked nicely. And by Robin Leslie. Also played well in Australia. Leslie. Kicks that one in, one-on-one -on -one contest. Oh, ooh, that was friendly fire. And down and hurt. As actually two players down, Johnson and one of the Arizona players is down hurt. They collided into each other. And one of the Seattle players is checking on it. And now they go in and now they're gonna blow the whistle. And getting up slowly, it looks like Cassie Cox. And yeah, it was, it was Cox and Johnson who are there, so it'll be a free kick now to Robin Leslie. And Leslie is not terribly that far out, maybe about 35 meters by the time she kicks the footy. Kick is on the way. The rough drop, it stays left. Mark, there were four hands on the footy, but it's Latia Holmes who takes it. So Holmes goes to the right, throws that on her left, and oh, running through and almost taking it was Estrada. Backing up there in defense was Leonard. And a low tackle is called, and Leslie will get a free kick. They'll set up the angle for Robin Leslie. A goal will put her team ahead. They're down nine to seven. Leslie. Kick is on the way. Looks pretty good. Her teammates like it, and so does the goal umpire. And San Francisco is at the front. Iron Maidens 2 1 13. Seattle 1 2 1 3 9. London Leslie. One, Le Le one Leslie and Lutz. That sounds like a law firm. Back in the middle of the ground. We mentioned the maidens coming in. I think a lot of people may have thought that as in their MO over the past couple of seasons has been to have a kind of a nondescript regular season and tear stuff up at, at regionals. Well, here they are again, at, or at nationals, and here they are at regionals right now in the lead. English, oh, there's Leslie. Leslie, oh, almost had a bounce, but it didn't come off. And barrels her way back in there, and then the umpire will cross his arms as that one is in there. Wow, Leslie was lucky. It clean bowled everybody, and she was able to get to it. And now there's Leon, throws that to the foot, and that one is off and out of bounds. Hey, Leon up and about as well. And I'll say this, for many years, Brett Brower had been the, really been the target, really had been the rooted in the ruck position, uh, and really had been stuck in as the ruck. And of course, with her, not playing over the last couple of tournaments because of the injury and now she is located down in Florida. So Leslie turns around for goal. Did she get it? Yes! Robin Leslie! If you don't mind, bootlegged around, threw it onto the right, through the eye of the needle. 
And San Francisco is going now, 3-1-19. And the lead is 10 points, 1-3-9. To finish the thought about Brower, when she went down in the, uh, in the International Cup, and of course Hallie Castanek, who is the ruck for Denver, when she had gone down previously, Meg Leone stepped in and did a fantastic job in the final game and a half for the for the USA Freedom in the International Cup. And then, of course, here, back here down in San Diego, as the Maidens won their second title in a row. But now it's good to see them use her elsewhere and the emergence of Panda Win who is doing a fine job in the rock. That's going to get cold as she stuck her knee. And just as I say that, I think the inexperience was there as she stuck her knee into the rib cage of, um, of Amelia Carr. And Carr may have had the wind knocked out of her. But you could see that. And they tell players not to do that on the rock, not to go and rise the knee. So just as we said, Panda Wynn, was doing such a fantastic job. She gives up the free kick there, and I don't think there was anything in it. 